Hello there gamers, Minecrafters, explorers, and adventurers, I am the Killer Gamer, and we're here with yet another mod pack. This is all the mods 7 to the sky. So as you would guess, with this picture off on the side, it is a skyblock game. But it is a variation of the all the mod 7 <coughs> mod pack. We're going to be doing this in hardcore mode, so hopefully we don't fall off the edge <laughs> into a uh, forever falling uh, state of doom. And we'll play for a hundred days and do a summary afterwards, so you'll get to see the full thing here. <clears throat> Let's call the. Uh, world name Killer Fly Away. Because <laughs> I don't know what else to call it. Aha! We are in some starter location. Where you can sit down, I assume. <laughs> Yep. There we go. Hey. <laughs> we are here. What did I just collect? I'm not sure what I just collected. <clears throat> A diorite pebble. Where in the heck did I get this from? Okay, welcome. All the mods seven to the sky. I think with all these, uh, all the mods, you the goal is to create this ATM star. So we got some commands here that we can type in. <coughs> Skyblock GUI is to start a team and choose your island. Then we got Skyblock Home that sends us to our island spawn point right here. Skyblock spawn to get back here. Skyblock team, allow visitors true, allows players to visit your island. And Skyblock visit team name to visit an island. So I wonder if, can we allow, oh, I'm supposed to put team. And allow, allow visit. True. You are currently not in a team. Well, nice. <laughs> I was wondering if that was going to happen. All right, Skyblock GUI. So here we create a new team. <clears throat> All right, looks like we got several different things here. We got a Farmer's Paradise, Cobbler's Delight. I hear Cobbler, and I think like Peach Cobbler, but no. Looks like that's a, your setup for a cobblestone generator is what it looks like right there. Which, actually, that's not too bad of an idea. I mean, you've got some... Some grass and and uh, dirt to work with there, and a tree. Then you've got just a tree. Now we've done some other sky blocks that are just on a tree, so 
How about something a little different? You've got something with a starter chest. The farmer's paradise is kind of neat because you got all the grass and stuff and the flowers. And you got an area there to put water. I kind of like that. You know what? I kind of like that. Let's go with the Farmer's Paradise. Oh, great. Let, yeah, let's make a name for ourselves. Alright. <clears throat> and here we go. So, let's see. Skyblock team allow visit true okay I think there's always a chance that if you go back to the uh, the spawn area that you may not be able to go back into your world but I don't know that for sure so look at that Oh, and you know what? All we have to do is... Bust this grass. That'll give us some seeds. take a look at our quest book here ATM to the sky welcome to ATM 7 now in the sky to get started with questing check out the tabs on the left right over here to jump in if you are new to all the mods make sure to check out the all the modium chapter where is that chapter oh there it is the next one if you are new to skyblock pat Packs or modded MC, check out the main quest line to help get you started. Mods are not gated by quests. Quests are optional. Okay. Just a couple of things there. So here is all the modium. Detailed guide to all the modium. We already have that book. Give us some experience points. And then here is the different quests. You've got all the modium ore, which is in the Twilight Forest. Vibranium ore. This is in the Nether's Warped Forest and Crimson Forest. And this raw unobtainium ore. <laughs> Does that mean it's unobtainable? Find this obtainable ore in the end. And then stuff that goes on from there. So it doesn't look like we're going to be doing that anytime soon. Here is some creative stuff. Tips and tricks. We can read this and get experience for it. Some easy stuff. Got compact machines, x-ray. So this is going to tell you a lot of nice stuff. got the bounty board here. Kill 100 zombies, kill 100 skeletons, 100 keep creepers. So, nice little thing here. All right, getting started. This is what we want to start with here. You've got a head start for those who want to skip forward, and then you got emergency saplings. So, if for some reason the tree doesn't drop a sapling, we can click this and it will give us one. Okay. Get her some, some steak.
let's go ahead and make our crafting table. And we'll set that bad boy right there. Did I just lose that piece of... Oh, shit. I guess that piece of wood flew off the edge. So what I want to do is create a platform around the edge here so that uh, we don't lose those saplings. Should be enough. One sapling dropped. <laughs> One sapling. Hopefully we'll get more. And you all know the drill in regards to making these trees grow. You crouch, 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 or basically torque and get that tree to grow. That way you don't have to sit there and wait for it to grow, because that's a kind of a waste of time. When you only only got one tree. I only got one sapling again. Come on now. Give me some saplings. slab so we can go ahead and I think we should be fine now in regards to that tree
take a look at our quest book. We've made our... Oops. Ah, we need to have... A total of eight logs. just realized we don't have a torch sitting here. I sure hope nothing spawns. Yes, we finally got two saplings. Good. Put the other one right there. So we have an oak nest. It's different. I don't know what that's for. Apparently it's for a mod called bees. So it must be bee related. Alright, we finished that quest there. Got ourselves some sticks. What do we got next here? got the oak barrel. The barrel is one of the most important ways to get materials in this pack. These can make clay using water, soul sand, using... Huh. Click for a tutorial. Okay, well, that doesn't do anything. I'm like, are we getting a command block? our barrel. Let's go ahead and put that right there. So when it rains it'll collect some water. Why don't we put a couple of barrels 
don't know if we need that much, but can't hurt. Oh, jeez. <laughs> I thought I heard something show up here. And it happens to be a wandering trader. How the hell did he get up on my island? I just I heard something. It went right in front of me. And I'm like, is it a creeper or what? No, it's just a wandering trader who's not minding his own business. Ah, okay, so you can put leaves in here and it turns it to dirt. Okay. Up next, making fluids. Okay. Oh, two different types of fluids. I don't know what that is there. Is that it? I guess so. Those are the only two th things we can do. Well, we can't put leaves in there. We don't have anything to uh, put that in there. Alright. Get ourselves some oak slabs. Alright. Slime balls are made with brown mushroom block and a slime block. Medium spores, when used on witch water, will turn into a brown mushroom block. Place the mushroom block down and break it for a chance at a brown mushroom. A brown mushroom, when used on witch water, will turn into a slime block. Alright. We won't be doing that anytime soon. Just like other sky blocks, you can get pebbles from right clicking grass. But here it works a little differently. You have a 50% chance for cobblestone petals and a 50% chance to get any other pebble variant. Alright. Well. Kind of right click here and get ourselves a whole bunch of pebbles. Because it's what you do. I don't even know why this trader's here. It's not like I'm going to get. Uh huh. It's not like I'm going to get any emeralds to do any trading. He's just going to get in my way. Can I make a sword? <laughs> Let's make a sword. Let's get rid of this guy. Oh, you know what? think. Let's see, can I use these two and still make a sword? No. Oh, it's worth a try, I guess. What's this? Finally. Okay. At least. <laughs> All these pebbles and stuff that we got. Alright, well, now that we have this, I'm gonna get rid of this guy. Well, especially the llamas. We don't need these llamas here. <laughs> All right, we'll keep him around. Let's 
Is that crooked? Or are my eyes funny? Alright, crooks will give you a much better chance of getting saplings and apples from leaves, but is also how to get silkworms. You will need these to get string for further progression. There are custom ponder tutorials for most, if not all, of the ex nihilo stuff. Okay, if I remember correctly, you make a hook like that. Okay, so we need to do some twerking here. I believe this is like, uh, what is it, the iGem Minecraft? You, yep, you take a silkworm and you infect a tree, and I think it infects all of it. Yep, there it goes. And here we go. This is the tutorial on that. And then here you go. You infest it, as you can see there. And then you take this and you get string, which we can do right now. Along with more silkworms. Well, we have plenty of string. I wish it was that easy normally. What else we got? We got the string. A hammer! To get resources, we'll need to bust up our cobblestone into something we conceive. This is where the hammer comes in. Place down the block you want to hammer and, well, hammer it. Remember, you can, ha you can hammer compressed items. Here's uh, soul sand. Hammering compressed items. To speed up getting resources, you can compress your cobblestone, gravel, etc., and hammer the compressed version to save time. With the nature of our automated slate sieving mod, we felt it was best not to allow these to be sieved. Okay, here is the oak sieve. Okay, we'll create a hammer. But here it is. Okay, so we're going to 
make this and make the string mesh. I've done this on iJam Minecraft also. So this is very similar. Two handles. Okay. Receive was. All right, we need oak. There we go. We need one other thing. String mesh. I didn't. Well, we created it. How come this isn't working? I wonder. Maybe we got to use it. right we have the hammer and decide let's put the pebbles here blackstone there oh that's salt and granite a whole bunch of silkworms all of this That gave us gravel. Well, that gave us flint. Okay, and are you going to tell me that... We, st we still didn't get this. Why? Oh, oh. Okay, why did we not get this? We created it. Hold W to ponder. 
Okay. <laughs> So you get stuff out of that. That can be useful. I don't even know what I'm doing. Do we need to make more than one? I have no idea. Maybe we'll just make another one. That didn't do anything. What is this thing broke? Oh, I think we need this hammer. We can't use a wooden hammer. I think that's the trick. All right. Yep, there's that. We got the quest for that hammer. Gotta get three gravel from it, okay. Get some more pebbles. That's <laughs> like, get out of my way. Wandering Trader is in my way!
Okay, we can make our furnace now. So we can start putting some torches and lighting our, our island up here. That way we don't get any more surprises. There we go. We got it. We had to... We had to finish those other quests first. We didn't really get anything from that, did we? Alright, so we need to use the hammer to make sand. Not going to be making soul sand anytime soon. I think we've got to sieve the gravel until we get sand. Continue to build out our island here.
skin on a little better. Pretty soon we can go ahead and build a fence around here. Then we can just run around at our heart's content and not have to worry about falling off. Cobblestone. farming hoe here and then start planting some seeds here notice I am building a platform that is three blocks out from each side. So three that way, three that way, and we'll do the same over here. Okay, so we got one block already. take that all the way down. Hey! And we still have a uh, couple of slabs left.
Oh, that's an oak nest. Apparently we can't do two. All right, what do we got here for our next quest? Oh yeah, the sand. Well, let's see what we can do with these two cobblestones here. Nothing. What are we doing wrong? <laughs> what are we doing wrong here? I think the wandering trader finally went away. Maybe he maybe he jumped off the edge to get his his llamas. Flint, that'll be useful. Ah, salt. Put that in there. I don't know, let's hammer this down and see what happens when we hammer down. I don't think it'll do anything, but... Whoops. Alright, well... Do it anyway. <laughs> that did give us sand. Okay. Okay. Let's see what we have now. Dust. Hammer times three. Clay. Fill a barrel with water and right click it with dust to get clay. Ah. And it hasn't rained yet. got our dust. Now we just have to wait for it to rain. In the meantime, uh, let's do some more tree dancing here. go ahead and get the wood that we need to make that fence. I will feel much better when we get that taken care of. I knew what to do with these bees. It's taking up room.
Oh, wow. It makes our plants grow, too. I did not think it did that. This corn. Industrial hemp fiber. Cut some more wood here. Might as well finish our fence while we're waiting for it to rain. I almost, almost thought I was going to fall over the edge there. Sticks. Another oak nest. What can we do with this? Does that change it to anything? I think it might. There we go. Now we can stack it, we just have to put it in there. might be on day four but hopefully nope we don't have enough fence yet but we are getting close we are getting close I 
know if we still need this crook or not. We'll set that right there. What day are we on? Does it say what day? Day three. This is day three. Oh, we got ourselves a nice big tree now. I am going to leave that tree there. We're not going to cut that one down. I love it when trees grow like that. there. Look up those logs and see what we can get. Those uh, the oak, the oak one, the 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 bee ones. One more. <laughs> we just need one more. And we got it. We've, we got to make all those torches, but... But yeah. Almost got it. Ah! I didn't put my tree there. Wish it would stop doing that to me. Place that tree. Oops, I have plenty of sticks. And there we go. We now have fence all around. Shouldn't have to worry about falling off the edge there. I think I'm gonna make another uh, seaver. Yeah. Where are you at? There you are. Why am I not making use of this thing? I put it right there. There we go. What are we doing now? Made the dust. We just gotta wait for it to rain. Well, hopefully it rains. Maybe we should make another... Another barrel? I don't know. It's crazy that it hasn't started raining yet. A flint mesh. With the flint mesh, you'll start getting some extra resources. If you're wondering what each mesh drops when sieving, you can always hit U and JEI on the mesh to check out the list.
Okay, well, let's look up mesh. And let's see, flint, 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 steel, string, flint. Oh, okay, we need our string one and we need that much flint. Which means we're going to need gravel. So we're going to need more stone. Get all of our pebbles here. Fruity pebbles and cocoa pebbles. Get all, get them all. Get our hammer. Where's our hammer? Not that one. managed to get something. We did get a flint. We're going to still need more. Yeah, we need a total of six flint. get these confused. I need to put a sign on it. You know, I can use this wooden hammer. Let's just use this thing until it... Until it breaks. Yeah, I think that was it. Oh! We got a bee! Look at that! It's a yellow carpenter bee. Well, now I think we know what those bee things are for. Oh, really? Wait a minute, that's what we got. Oh, okay, I didn't see it. We're gonna need two of those.
see how this works here. I'm supposed to get better resources with that flint, and I think we did. All right, we did that. Nice, 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 nice. Okay, clay, we're still waiting for rain. You can compress your cobblestone, gravel, etc., and hammer the compressed version at the same time. Okay. I think... Silver pieces. Oh, yeah. Why do I have my stone axe in there? What did I do? Niter. Oh, I got enough flint to make another mesh. Goody, 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 goody. Goody, 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 goody. Can upgrade this stuff. Uh, trees kind of like that. Thirty two torches, I think we should have enough here. Put three spaces in between. We'll just need to start making our uh, little tree farm on the outside there. I've got that planned on a another uh, rain finally. Took forever.
It's filled. Alright, so. Dust. Put the dust in there. Getting our clay. <laughs> nice. We got our clay. Okay. All fired up. I mean, it's a skyblock. No matter how many different power generation methods we try to show you in these quests, you will ultimately end up with 20 of these in your base. These generate lava when a heat source is placed underneath it. You can use a torch to start with, even though it is slow. Fill with some sort of cobblestone. Okay. So we gotta put a torch underneath it. So what is this again? Fired crucible. We gotta get an unfired one. Porcelain clay. Ah, clay and bone meal. Which somehow we need to make bone. Bone block. Aha. Nope. Ha! Hmm. How can we make this? We've got clay balls. Got that. But somehow we need bone mail. That's going to be a problem. We don't have any bones. Well, I got bones, but... I don't think I'm going to... sacrifice them for this... Uh, this situation. Oh darn, I thought we could make a pot. Or a bucket or something. I don't know, maybe we can. Give me a bucket. Give me a clay bucket or something. Clay. Molten clay. Ah! Darn it. Yep. Got tons of... Well... Guess we're not getting that. What day are we on? We're still on day three? Can't be on day three. We were on day we were on day three yesterday. Iron mesh. Well, not going to make that anytime soon. Diamond mesh, emerald mesh, the final mesh. Once you have a flint mesh, you will start to get basic materials from sieving, like iron. Combine your ore pieces and make yourself raw ones. Then throw them in your furnace to smelt them. You get scrambled eggs <laughs> as a result. Then a furnace upgrade. If you surround a furnace with iron, you can upgrade your furnace. These smelt faster. It can also be configured to be automated with the cog wheel in the top left of the GUI. Oh, start a farm. Oh, this is the food and farming chapter. 
Yep. We're gonna have to wait until we get bones. I guess we're gonna have to... Let's take a look at this. Crucible heat sources are important as they make your lava production faster. This mod pack has a few changes to the norm. Oh, never mind. Can't click on that. We gotta get bones. We gotta get bones. Brown mushroom block. Mycelium spores when used on witch water. We gotta make witch... Okay, how do we make witch water? I wonder. Witch water? Witch water. Fluid transport. No! We can't do any of that. <laughs> we can't do any of that. Water... It doesn't do anything. Ah. We are on day four. And I got food. I gotta make some more, uh... I gotta make some more chess. Okay, so... We'll go ahead and stop here. What we're going to do on the next episode is I'm going to start making some more of these. Uh, and maybe we'll put it out here in the corner so we can get more of them. We'll keep the barrels here. As a matter of fact... Oh, I got bone mail. How did I get that? Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. We need a porcelain clay and bone. Oh. <laughs> I, we got what we needed the whole time. Hold on. We're not done yet. We're not done yet. Oh. What was it? Unfired something. Unfired. That's it. Yes. Nice. Okay. We're going to put that right there. Is that going to fill up with water? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know if it's going to fill up with water. All right, hold on. Quest book. There it is. There we go. Okay, so remember... Okay, no matter how many methods of power generation, these generate lava when a heat source is placed underneath it. Don't you need to put something underneath it? Hmm. I don't know. I have no idea if that's going to work or not. Something I want to do, though. Let's see if this works. Alright, it says it's supposed to be slow, so who knows? Uranium block.
these generate lava when a heat source is placed underneath it. Fill with some sort of cobblestone. Okay, got it. We don't have cobblestone. Okay. Some kind of cobblestone. Hold on. I don't know. Can we use diorite? Will that work? See if we can get some more dye right here. We got some extra porcelain. Where's all the pebbles at? Oh, we've been getting nothing but stone. Well, I do have regular cobblestone here. How hard is it going to be to get dire right here? Got it. Whoops. I think one more will fill it up. Got tons of stone and the side the salt. Keep going. <laughs> Try not to get that. We still don't have any diorite. Look at this. Some of it looked like it was diorite. Got granite. Blackstone. Finally, all right. Okay, that is filled up. We got all this stone pebbles here. Cobblestone. 
All right, well, yep, that is doing its thing. Oh. And the, uh, okay, so we've done a full, we've done days one through four. Cool. All right, well, I got to finish uh, doing some cooking, so... Yeah, so when we get back on the uh, next episode with day five, um, we're going to move these sieves over here into the corner and upgrade them with the flint. And we'll just, they were saying five by five, so we'll do a five by five. One, two, three, four. And one, two, three, four. So we're going to extend it out a little bit. But even then, we're going to have a lot of stuff here. So, yeah, so we'll do that. And meanwhile, this will cook and we'll make lava. And I know from there, we'll be able to make a cobblestone generator. And we'll need to come up with a place to be able to do that. So we're not burning things up because we don't want to do that. Not on our island. Du -du 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 -du. All right. Well, thanks for watching. And I will see you on the next episode. Have a killer, awesome day.